Hello everyone, welcome back to another watching. Well today we're not actually going to take a look at any watches, but we'll be doing a box opening on a pen I received and I wanted to take a look at some of the previous pens I have purchased before what a pen had a subscription and a couple pens that I received last month that I didn't do a box opening on. Um, I don't know why I didn't do a box opening. It kind of hit me after the fact. So I was introduced to what a pen through one of the watch company or one of the watch groups I, I'm in on Facebook. So obviously Randall over at what a pen is a watch guy. And it's funny because last month, one of the guys I follow on YouTube, which if you guys haven't check him, checked him out yet, you should go over to my watch addictions. Um, he did his box opening for what a pen last month and I went man all of us watch guys are kind of into pens or, or possibly into some of the similar stuff so this month I'm going to do a box opening on it and we're going to take a look at a few of the pens I purchased previously and the pens I received on my subscription from last month just to keep a watch in the video I am wearing my Aragon Dive Master that I just did a box opening on and Stay tuned for the follow-up on that one. So the first pens I actually bought from Randall over at What A Pen were these two. So this one, I actually work in the automotive industry. I love that it had tires and uh, a gear shift bolt action design here. And uh, I just had to have one. Now, I love the pens. Now, some of these pens are a little worn. I've had them for a little while, so don't don't pay too much attention to some of the wear because I've actually used this pen a considerable amount. I actually like to use this pen with the lid off. I don't know why. I love how it fits in my hand, but there's definitely some wear here. And actually, I'm sure if I reached out to Randall, he would hook me up or, or sell me the, the pieces to make this one look perfectly new again. So Randall gets just some incredible composite metals and wood and awesome, just awesome wood to create these pens. And this was a hobby for him and it has turned into a small business and it's awesome. I mean, so we have the, you know, we have the gear shift style pen. We have screw on the screw on cap with I can't remember what this composite metal is called and I don't know if I could pronounce it if I did because it is an interesting name for sure. Um, this pen I actually really like. It's got a magnetic snap on cap which is nice. It's funny because I was getting, I had just ordered my Orient Trooper with the red dial. And I, I emailed Randall and just said, hey man, next time you are making something with red, let me know, I'll probably be interested. And it was, I think within a, a fairly short period of time, he said, I think I've got something I'm doing uh, and I'll you know shoot you a picture when I'm done. So this is what he came up with, had to have it. I, it matches the Orient Trooper really well. And uh, I think there's quite a few pictures of me holding, you know, the pen next to the watch just because it's super cool. Um, this one popped up as one of the ones he was doing. It was just a nice composite stainless, you know, another snap cap rollerball pen and super cool. Like I said, I think it's funny that I'm into pens because I have the worst handwriting in the world. So now... Well, those are a, a few of the pens that I purchased before Randall had come out with the subscription. And now he's actually branched out a little bit. There's a few more options on the subscription wise. I'm on the $80 a month. That's with shipping included. And that will get you a pen set if it's a wood pen or one of the metal composite pens, I believe. So it'll be interesting to see what I've got in this one, in this package because I really don't know. Now, um, the card it came with last month tells the tells a little bit about the pen and the wood. So we got chrome twist caps, roller ball, and a fountain pen 
with Goncalo Alves Wood. Don't even know. <laughs> so let's take a little closer look at this one. So this is the rollerball. And that wood is just super cool. And I, you know what, I recommend you guys go to his, um, check out his Facebook page. Go to What A Pen on the Facebook page and you can scroll back and see a lot of the video. He's got videos on there of him turning down the wood, turning down the different metals and creating some of the pens. Um, and you can see some of the past creations, which I think are just awesome, you know, for, I think somebody that's been able to take a hobby and expand it and it's all handcrafted. I mean, this is all turned down wood and put together by him, I think is awesome. So this one, the second pen in the set is the fountain, fountain style pen, which is interesting. I've never had a pen like this. It came with a cartridge to, you know, plug in and get to go. And I actually uh, had to, I reached out to Randall and said, you know what, man, what, what do you do if it dries out? I don't, I'm not sure it's the first fountain style pen I've had. And he's like, oh, you know, just take a, take a damp paper towel and, you know, wipe it down and it'll, it'll start going again. So really cool. I, I mean, it's cool that he's been super helpful and answered questions and, you know, able to kind of pair a pen for a watch for me. And some of his creations are really, really cool. Like I said, I mean, I, I scrolled back and saw that he had even gotten some wood out of a garage floor from Fort Dix that was reclaimed wood and used it to create some bolt action style pens. Um, I've also seen some laser engraving on some of his creations and super awesome. So enough about talking about what I've seen or what I've got already. Um, I don't know if I mentioned he has a lower, lower tiers of the subscriptions where you can get a single wood pen. Uh, it's $45 with shipping included. And that is for a fountain ball, a fountain, a roller ball or a fountain style pen. So with that being said, I am excited to see the creation for this month. So let's open this bad boy up and take a look. All right, so once again, we've got pen, we've got card. So we've got a chrome bolt action pen with M3 Damas Damascus steel metal composite not just a personal touch it's a just a personal touch not machine made super awesome couple more cards i do pass this dude's cards out so i'm sure you know hopefully he's gotten some business business off of me um spaces are limited it's a guy in, in doing his hobby so if a space opens up for the subscription i would say jump on it and if he has some pens made something that you're interested in they're not going to stick around very long wow look at that that is flipping cool i am like I am super excited about this one. Honestly, this may be my new favorite go-to. So this is what my $80 subscription got me this month. And look how cool that is. If you guys are into pens, like I said, it's weird because I think a lot of watch guys and we're into the similar stuff. And uh, man, that's cool bolt action which some of these pens with the bolt actions and the gear shifters and whatever are good if you're a kind of a fidgeter like me but uh yeah i think that's going to be my new my new go-to it looks like you can unscrew the top and screw in a i don't know what you want to call it like the the ipad stylus kind of top on it but wow so Randall, if you actually end up uh, checking this video out, man, you knocked it out of the park. Super awesome. I'm very excited. As always, guys, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. 
And I'll throw it out there. If you guys have any other subscriptions or any, any watches you want me to check out specifically, let me know in the comments below. Thanks, guys.